it seems like they've got to get themselves in a certain mindset for this, isn't it? It's different to slalom. It's, uh, it's a bit of a war out there. It really is a war. Now, this morning we saw on the right-hand side of the screen, that is definitely the best place to be starting from. So that is Camille Prigent from France in the red bib. Let's see if she gets off. And look at that straight away. Stephanie Horn tries to take her out. So Prigent in the red vest is away quick. So Steffi Horn right next to her in the green. And they come down here. They've got to decide which side of the course they're going to go to now. They've got two, they've got two choices. Neck and neck, left and right. And it's uh, Prigent and Horn. Look at that sneaky move from the Italian, Stephanie Horn. She's moved into the front. Yes. Mintel over on the other side of the course got the best of the start over there. Still a very close Ooh. close race here, Ross. Wow, look at that. I think that's the closest we've seen them all through this, this start this area of the course. And see how they go to this three fourths. It's a tight little move. Claire Walinska buffeted out the back, but it's Stephanie Horn in front. Oh, she's gone low. I think she's going to be okay, though. Yep, she's okay. Mintel over second. Prigent third. Oh, big move there from Zwolinska. Very good from Zwolinska. Oh, they all went low, apart from Zwolinska nailing the move and overtaking. So, Stephanie Horn in front. This is the compulsory role that all the athletes have to do. Mintelova second. It's uh, Zwolinska third. And now here... Ooh, oh! Just... They, they tell you what, they've left Mintelova to her own devices. But look at her. What's she doing what is, over there? What is she doing? Oh, no. What is she doing? Oh, Aliska Mintelova, she had it all to herself. And she just made an absolute mess of it. And that has meant Stephanie Horn has gone through first. Cammy, oh, and I think, unfortunately, Zwolinska, you're out. You went the wrong side of the pole. The pole went the wrong side of the pole. Yeah. We've seen that a couple of times um, this afternoon, haven't we? Where that someone's been out in front, they just need to do the upstream uninterrupted and they can't make it happen. They just could not Mintelova. make it happen. Yeah, Mintelova. It's all yours. She was, she was on that, on all by herself on one side of the course. She got served up the hors d'oeuvres, the entree and the main meal all at once, and she couldn't even get past the the finger food at the start, and she got stuck there, and do not pass go, do not collect 200. Yeah. It must be a, it's a frustrating position, position when you're uh, just stuck in behind that gate and you can't yeah. get it to move. Yeah. It's just the, torture. The gate... The gate cannot be your friend sometimes. But look at Stephanie Horn getting the business done. Cami Prigent uh, has moved, has taken second. Claudia Zwolinska went on the wrong side of the gate at the finish, so she has a fault. Look at that clever move there from Stephanie Horn. Just moved under Prigent. And then look here, they were really going for it. Yeah, so they all slide a little low. And watch up the back as Walinska just nails the moving and overtakes Prejant at this point of the yeah. race. Yeah, yep. look at this. Oof. So at this Beautiful. stage, Mintelova was looking good. And then the whole race opened up for her, the Slovakian, because everybody else went to the other side of the course. So Mintelova, she would not have been able, she would not have believed how it was unfolding. And there on the wrong side of the pole, unfortunately, for the pole. We didn't see Mintelova getting stuck on the gate back there on the last upstream, but that's where it all fell apart.